Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 28th. There are a couple flies in here, so you may see them. Anyway, um, the timing is fluid. This reading is timeless. It's not sign specific either. This is what's coming in. And, you know, I hear all the time that it's a couple days. Sometimes it's the day of. So you really need to, sometimes it's the day of. Sometimes it's a couple days later. Sometimes it's way later. So keep that in mind. I have gotten a lot of requests this last week in particular from people about, you know, not being able to book a reading because I had them all shut down. I have been looking for another scheduling site and I finally chose one. Took me a minute to get it all set up. It's all set up. I'm going to put the link underneath. I also put it in my community tab if you want to book a reading. I only, I only opened up a week's worth for now because it, it took me so long to set it up. But tonight when I'm relaxing, I will open up more slots for September. Um, so check back. Um, I'm also going to be doing a live here soon just to give you some updates on some things. Um, I don't know if it's going to be tonight. It may, but it may not. So stay tuned for that. But anyway, what do we have for around the 28th? I'm going to be doing a live right here on Soul Source Tarot. So what do we have for around the 28th? Three of Cups reversed. Now that is parting of ways. It's some sort of termination. There's a lot of gossiping going on. We have an enemy that is disguised as a friend that really isn't a friend that is talking behind somebody's back. Two of Swords. Uh, somebody's wearing a mask. They're not seeing. They're not seeing that they're dealing with somebody that is not being honest in denial. This is divided loyalty as well. Having a hard time choosing, blocking the truth, not wanting to see, not wanting to accept something. Now this party is over. A friendship is over or something like that, but this is kind of like being in denial. death so this is a denial over an ending okay this is a change a change that is needed you know we have a change that is needed there is going to be a parting of ways of a partnership because twos are partnerships could have to do with a friend that really isn't a friend but doesn't have to be um, could be the end of a third party situation as well. You know, if there has been a third party, it could be coming to an end. Death is an ending that leads, that leads to a new beginning. It gives, it opens a new door. So a new door is opening that has been blocked. Okay. This is being blocked. Somebody was torn between two directions, having a hard time making a decision but that period of stagnation, per se, is coming to an end. This is an ending that opens a new door. There's a separation with a third party. That's what I see. Ah, the Emperor reversed. Now, the Emperor reversed is somebody that diver des deserts you in the time of need. This is somebody that lacks experience, that is mean, uh, that doesn't have a lot of discipline, that acts impulsively. Uh, this may be a tyrant, you know? Somebody that, that looks for somebody else that is weak or, you know, because they like to be in control. The emperor in reverse is somebody that is very mean-spirited, that doesn't like responsibility. Now this is blocked. So somebody may have blocked this person. Or they may have blocked. Somebody's been blocked. The star reversed. Now the star reversed is why, why, why? Why is this happening? Why is this ending happening? 
There's a lack of faith. There's a lack of hope. It's a hope. It's hopeless, right? Not happy, unhealing, not healing. Uh, the star reversed. Why is this happening right now? Somebody has to make a decision because this two of swords is a decision. It's a painful decision. It feels like they're receiving some sort of opportunity for a new beginning with somebody. And they have to make a decision. Maybe this person involved them in a third party. This emperor in reversed is uh, very entitled. They feel like they're entitled. This person has a big ego. This is feeling ashamed. We have a lot of arrogance here. We have an arrogant individual that may be a feeling ashamed of their actions. What is, what is this emperor doing? Knight of Pentacles. So putting in effort. We have, we have an individual that deserted somebody because of their ego, perhaps. Now they're going to be putting in effort. They're looking to gain something. Maybe they're, they're, now they want to accept responsibility because the Knight of Pentacles takes on responsibility after not wanting to take responsibility. Somebody is willing to put in effort to re to receive something for their gain. They're trying to maybe they're trying to gain respect back. This emperor in reversed was emotionally cold, you know. But now they may be in a hopeless situation where they're needing some sort of Stability. Hmm. Queen of Cups reversed. Whoever this Emperor in reversed is, I think that they got themselves involved with a third party, with somebody that was emotionally unavailable. Okay? The Queen of Cups in reversed is somebody that is very needy, very clingy very um, closed off emotionally or cries all the time. There's heartbreak here. So there could be some upcoming tears. Okay, there could be some tears that are coming. Because this is why is this happening? Why, 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 why? This is the death of something it's the end of something so we have something that is coming to an end and there could be some tears that are shed this is nothing to celebrate with the three of cups reverse this is parting of ways and this has to do with a father or a boss or somebody in a position of authority that uh, it feels like this person is Oh, that's a big pentacle right there. It has a golden opportunity to go someplace else. Because you notice this guy has turned his back. He's going someplace. So whoever this emperor is in reverse probably made some poor decisions. Now this is a huge golden opportunity. I don't know if you can see the pentacle there. It's a huge one. It's a huge opportunity to go build someplace else. Okay, I'm going to go plow over here. I'm going to go over here. Gonna go do it over here. It's more fertile. They're gonna go someplace else, and I think whoever this person is is gonna be heartbroken. I feel like this is a, a definitely uh, painful. It is with that two of swords. That's a painful choice. It's a painful decision that brings some sort of heartbreak and sadness to whoever this person is. Why is this happening right now? Somebody may have been in denial of, you know, whatever was happening and, and ignoring the signs. Death is an ending, okay? It is an ending. It's a profound life change. It's a transition. Six of 
six of wands reversed the six of wands reversed is uh no staying power losing right it's losing a battle somebody is is losing a battle i think it has to do with their health The world reverse. Somebody could be leaving without saying goodbye because that death is right above the world reverse. The world reversed is, you know, lack of will, um, lack of success. Next to the six of wands reverse, lack of success again. This is about accepting and cutting your losses. You may not get the closure that you think that you needed. I think we we have an ending here that comes very suddenly. I'm just going to be honest with you. There is some sort of poor health illness. Star card reversed is illness. And this is loss of will. Don't can't fight anymore. Don't want to fight six of wands reverse. This is like this is losing a battle. Unsuccessful, you know, somebody is not finding the success. They aren't, you know, whatever. Something is coming to an end. And there's there's like It's, there's unfinished business. They, 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 they leave some unfinished business behind. Put it that way. Now, this is lack of, of uh, completion. It's like it's over, but it's not. Why? 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 This is why. Why has this ended? Why wasn't it successful? It wasn't successful because of ego. Okay, the Emperor Reverse is full of ego. We may have somebody here that works, works, worked, work, 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 you know. Well, it's almost like they work themselves to death. Anyway, that three of cups reversed is parting ways. This party is over. It's over. <laughs> Moon, all is not as it seems. There are hidden forces here. Proceed with caution. Beware. Beware, there's something that is unseen here. We have somebody that is... Uh, It's, it's, it feels like we have illusion here. There's some sort of illusion. We have It's almost like denial. That's what it is. We have an individual that is in denial that has been hiding. And this is feelings. Hiding or denying the truth or something like that. Now this, this is, the moon is ruled by shadow. All is not as it seems. Somebody may seem like they're healthy. They're, I think there's poor health here. I think there's poor health. And I feel like... Uh, there's some unseen problems that are about to uh, show up. We have some, this is an action card. There's been a delay. Somebody has been delaying, you know, following their intuition or following their gut or seeing the truth or speaking the truth or whatever. They've been in denial, emotionally closed off. They've been ignoring their feelings. Ignoring their feelings, no kidding. Ignoring their intuition. Pretending that everything is okay when it's not. I think there's going to be a major upset with the emperor reversed. Whoever this emperor in reversed is, this person 
is deserting somebody or has deserted somebody and they have hidden their feelings below the surface and you know stress kills when you bury your emotions or you bury your feelings they're going to eat you alive now we do have an opportunity for stability here with this knight of pentacles this is about putting in effort we have somebody here that is going to grab a new opportunity period they're fearful though this is fear there's fear because I, I feel like they're fearful because they, maybe they're fearful of rejection They may have gotten themselves into a third party or into a situation with where it was unsuccessful. Hmm. This death card is a is a new beginning. It's an ending that leads to a new beginning. It's a profound life change after something does not end successfully. This is lack of success. There's lack of wish fulfillment here. Somebody's wishes, you know, they, 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 they made a poor decision, put it that way. Because they ignored their feelings. And they ignored their feelings and buried them probably with drugs or addictions or pills or whatever you want to call it. Doesn't even, it could be food. They buried their, their feelings with addictions. And now there's there's uh, anger. And sadness. There is sadness here. Oh, Ten of Swords reverse. Now Ten of Swords is, is something, you know, it's a it's a death experience. And we have the death card here. It's like the worst has happened. It's like things have gotten worse. We have somebody here that has some chronic health problems and they're getting worse and worse and worse and they've been ignored. These problems have been ignored. Somebody could end up having a near death experience or they may not even survive and I'm just being honest here. I'm, you know, they may not survive because they're ignoring the signs. I know that's what we have. And they're ignoring their intuition and they're ignoring their heart because these, the, the Queen of Cups is about heart. Okay? Somebody is ignoring their heart. They're ignoring their gut. They're ignoring their intuition. The two of the two of swords is ignoring. Okay? Pretending. In denial. Everything's okay. It's not okay. It's not okay. Now the ten of swords in reversed is you may or may not survive. We have some severe health problems here that has been caused a lot by stress, by ignoring your heart and ignoring your intuition and not following your heart, you know, and whatever. I think we have a, an ending that happens um, suddenly. Out of the blue. Just comes out of the blue. It's just all of a sudden. Somebody sees that new door and they go through it. And they just uh, part ways. They part ways from somebody that it's over with. Put it that way. Um, this death card is a profound change. It's a transition. Somebody's going through a transitionary period. And I feel like they are, and something could be coming back that died a long time ago. And, and, and that's like metaphorically something coming back from the dead. We could have a person here that is, um, that was in, say, a relationship and they're coming back. They're, there's unfinished business and they're coming back. Um, maybe they're going to apologize with this Knight of Pentacles. That could, this is a golden opportunity. Sometimes people will come back when there's some sort of difficult period in a person's life. They take that opportunity to apologize. And I feel like that's what we have here.
Look at that. That's going right through that sword. I have somebody here that's been having been been in a lot of pain. They've been in a lot of pain. They've been ignoring it. We do have a completion here. We have an ending. We do. We do have an ending here. And it's it's uh somebody's been ignoring their their something they've been ignoring their health or they've been ignoring their heart or they've been ignoring their feelings and i think that there's going to be a lot of whys why 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 there they may be somebody may be feeling ashamed they may be feeling ashamed for not uh taking action when they should have they delayed they stalled because of ego, you know, or they were too busy. If they had a business or they had to work on their lawn or whatever, you know, they, they were too uh, focused on everything but their heart. Um, somebody may feel like they're a failure because this is a fail and this is a fail so it's like they feel like they're a failure and that's sad that is sad and it is sad it is definitely sad and it's because and the reason they feel that way is because they didn't put an effort when they were supposed to you know anyhow um, and now they have to laugh they made their bed you know and they have to lie in it right and now they're suffering we do have suffering here we have somebody here that is suffering big time I think there's regrets. I do feel like there is some sort of regrets. I feel like there is uh, something is about to be shown. Something has been missed. King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles is somebody that is very loyal, very real hard working somebody's about to put in effort they may they may come with an apology or come with a gift or, or something like that the king of pentacles comes with something in their hand the time is ripe you see the ripeness the time is ripe this person is solid they are stable they are secure they uh, are abundant it's time. It's time for them to make an offer or to do something. This person is very cunning and clever and hardworking. And they are coming with an offer. This person is coming with some sort of offer. Whoever this person is, they are very focused on their money. They're focused on their business. And now they're grabbing an opportunity. You see it here. Now it's in his hands. We do have an individual that is, is taking an opportunity. I think this person has been hiding their feelings. And they're going to come out of hiding. But they're fearful because this is fear. Fear, I think there's fear of, of rejection or fear of, um, opening their heart because the, the two of swords, the swords block the heart. There could be a heart blockage. I don't know why I'm saying that. Anyhow, this is unblocking the heart. opening up and expressing feelings somebody's going to be expressing their feelings we do have a new beginning here there's unfinished business with somebody that you know 
they need to say something. The lovers, this is a contract that ended. I feel like we have a contract that has ended. A soulmate contract that ended. It failed. It failed because of ego. It failed because of ego. It failed because of somebody's need to control. And there's unfinished business with this partner. I think whoever this person is that let their ego get in the way is being haunted. I feel like this person is being haunted. And I feel like they are going to uh, take an opportunity to express themselves. And I think that's funny. I don't typically say that kind of thing. There's been some sort of separation. And I think there's a separation from a third party where they can reconnect with the person that they are meant to be with and i don't i don't know where that's coming from could be dealing with a taurus virgo capricorn a gemini pisces cancer scorpio 10 of pentacles short reverse short lived success somebody got into a situation just for the money they were too focused on their money and perhaps everything is falling apart because they chose materialism instead of love or something like that. And that's why things don't become successful. It's the wrong set of values. Anyhow, this is short-lived success. This is like losing it all. We got bad business. We have the collapse of an empire. I think we have some family drama here or family dynamics. There's a change in, in the home even. Somebody's moving. Somebody got themselves involved with a third party that doesn't, didn't belong. And it was all to prove a point with that emperor reversed. The lover's reverse is the end of a contract that is not compatible. And this is the death. Death of a contract that is not compatible, that was based on security only, not love. But it doesn't end successfully. It ends, you know, without love. And we have this individual that is... <clears throat> was very focused on their money and their business and all that that is experiencing an ending in their life. This person is taking a golden opportunity, it looks like, to go someplace else, to plant their seeds someplace else. They're going to go, you know, someplace else. We do have an, a major ending here. It's the ending of a false contract that was built on, you know, somebody may have just married for money or they got in a relationship just to fill a void. It wasn't for love. That contract is ending. And this person is, is taking their, taking an opportunity to break free. This is break free. It's liberation. Somebody is breaking free from a third party contract that they uh, are not meant to be with. And they're going to be do acting with integrity. I don't know if somebody's getting an apology or what. Good luck. <laughs>